Today I'm going to talk to you about face shapes and I'm going to help you know how to identify your own face shape so that you can choose the sunglasses that will suit you. So, in order to identify your own face shape, the first thing you need to do is to tie your hair back like these ladies have done, because you need to be able to actually see your face properly to ascertain what shape of face you have. If you just look at your face in the mirror and try and think, well, which one am I? That's often quite difficult to sort of sort of work out which one you are. So here's a little trick and a technique for making that easier. What you need to do is you need to look at the area from your temple to your jaw. Okay, don't look at the whole face, just from the temple to the jaw. And have a look at that and see whether it's quite a straight line or whether it's quite a curved line. So on Sarah, this line here is actually very, very curved, which tells you that Sarah either has a round or an oval face shape. So it's one of the softer, more curvier face shapes. On Isabel, you'll see that from the temple to the jaw is actually much more of a straighter line in quite a contrast. This means that Isabel has a more angular face. If you have an angular face, then you look better in a more curvy, more soft frame. And if you have a soft, more curvy face, you look better in an angular frame. So the idea is that you're actually trying to contrast with what you have already. You're very lucky to have an oval face because people with oval faces can pretty much wear any glasses that they like. Generally though, they look really good in big kind of jet set style glasses. So really deep glasses. When we talk about depth, we actually mean the height of the eye shape here. So really deep glasses look good with some nice embellishments and details on the side as well. So a really kind of fun frame to wear. So Isabel has a rectangular face because the distance from her temple to her jaw is, at, is a long distance again. These ones are kind of a different style, but if we turn to the side here, we'll see there's lots of detail. There's this lovely turquoise colour, there's this embellishment to actually attract the attention of the eyes to the side to actually make the face appear wider. And that's how to choose sunglasses to suit you.